Hello all. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have done this texturing part over here. Let's continue this. So now we are going to texture this chairs. So let's select all the chairs over here. So right now, I am going to select this chairs. Let's go into material. Let's take a V-Ray material. Let's give a white color give a bit of no reflection if you want you can give a reflection over here chairs and assign this texture over here so select the stage part select all of this material and let's take one more V-Ray material Let's give again a V-Ray material and just assign the color. The roughness if you want you can just give a bit of roughness to it. Can give a roughness. Now what I am going to do over here is like I am just going to go over here take a cylinder make a cylinder over here just drag this and very important uh, remove the height segments and push it in positive over here so let's just select this define this so just shift and drag it over here So just uh, delete, select all of this over here. Shift and drag. Say OK. Select all of this. Subtract this. Uh, go into material. material let's take a V-Ray material name it as a glow over here and pick a color let's give this color so I don't want in the diffuse I want it into the reflection or uh, sorry not reflection we can set it into the incandescence for that we can use the incandescence option that's your self illumination just click and take it like this increase its multiplier and assign it so select this 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 and this and assign this white material as we have applied it over here in the same manner you want that's it so you can go into this rendering rendering render setup and you can go into this uh, common set to HD and you can just check the render let's just check the render you can just remove the background so the reflection is too high we can just uh, reduce this ground reflection to bit very very less 
so you can just go into the environment and remove this and give a white color or something and just render it you can see this so now if you want to give or you want to just light up this stuff just go into the material and let's give this the same stuff over here then you will see that this will also give you the glow effect so we have not defined any kind of lights yet over here we have not defined any kind of uh, lights over here yet So you can define the lights if you want. So we have totally defined it as more of a yellowish part, uh, sorry whitish part. We can switch a bit of its color to bit a bit towards a bit more of yellowish. Alright. So save your file. So shift F, that's your wireframe. Uh, save frames. So thanks for watching this tutorial.